Hey, what's up guys? My name is Stuart Rees. I'm a guitarist, a singer and a songwriter and today I am playing at a wedding in French Hook, South Africa and I'm using the HK Polar Column Array. What I'll do is I'll set this camera up and get some footage of myself playing um, and hopefully you can get an idea of how this thing sounds. Uh, bear in mind I'm using a cell phone to record this so it might not be the truest reflection but hopefully you'll get an idea and then at the end of this video I'll just sort of give you my opinion on the system. that you guys know the area that we're working in here um, this is the post ceremony drinks and snacks about 120 guests here today um, and this column array I'm in the corner here this column array is covering this area pretty comfortably um, it's just acoustic music but it's still throwing really far and it's sounding clear uh, over the whole space in what I'm using it's a Shure Beta 87 a microphone and then I've got a loop station some reverb a tremolo some drive for when I'm improvising and a tuner that's my guitar and today I am using an Allen & Heath ZED 10 FX mixing desk and that is because this little mixer on the back of the column array although it's really cool and has enough channels it doesn't have any reverb and it also doesn't really have much EQ I'll quickly show you what you can do you can sort of EQ the master there's high mid you can actually sweep the mid frequency and a low boost or cut um, and then there's this mode option obviously a voice for speech DJ for dance music I'll set it on music um, and then there's a bunch of other options sorry wrong way but I'm not going to get into that now um, so quite a bummer that there's no reverb or no uh, EQ but um, one thing about this system is that it looks damn good I use the RCF Evox J8 as my main PA and I think it sounds amazing but in all honesty it doesn't look this good Darkly she's all I see Go come and rest your bones With me Driving slow on Sunday morning I 
Alright, so I'm done and I think it sounds really, really good. I'm not going to show you how to uh, set it up and how it sort of comes apart because there are millions of unboxing videos available, but I'll quickly tell you what I think are the pros and cons. Pro number one being the price. Uh, here in South Africa it's around 13,000 Rand, um, almost unheard of for a column array, definitely unheard of for any HK audio gear, which is really, really high end gear. Um, so price, fantastic. It comes with bags as well. Um, so if you're like me and you like to keep your gear looking neat, that's also a bonus, not having to go and get bags made or order extra bags, it just comes out with them. Um, throws really far. Um, it's got a nice tight load, only a 10 inch sub, but uh, it's a nice and low, nice and tight. And uh, con was, I think, it's probably just the fact that it doesn't have reverb on it. If you're, if you're a DJ or you're doing sort of stuff where you're just doing speech, I don't think you're going to get something much better at this price, um, or at least of this quality at this price. But um, as a singer and a guitarist, what I do, you're going to have to take a desk with you or at least have uh, a vocal pedal or something with reverb on it. But uh, all in all, I'll say you can't go wrong. I think it's a really good piece of gear at a really good, piece, at, at a really good price. Um, if you have any questions, you're welcome to ask. I'll do a separate video where I go through the, the, um, the whole mixer and what all it can do. Uh, it's a little bit limiting, but I'll still sort of show you what I do. And um, if you have any questions for me, you're welcome to ask. Good luck to all you guys out there. Cheers.